Oh, so I'm doing another day in my life. I recorded some yesterday, so I might do a week in my life. We'll see. Um, it's now Wednesday, and I get Thursday and Friday off, and I work the weekend. Because I had um, requested Thursday and Friday off because I'm getting my second vaccine. I'm going to go to cookout right now because I'm freaking hungry. It's 1.31. Let me know if y'all want a morning routine and a night routine. But I'm going to start working double shifts, 16-hour shifts, so I don't have to work five days a week. And I talked to the girl about that because I'm starting school back. I'm working five, six, seven, like, okay, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I would have been working six days in a row. I can't do that in school because the one off day I get, I'm going to be, um, you know, sleeping. 12 hour shifts so they work with me i'm gonna be working 16 it's gonna be overnight evening and morning evening and night and i don't care i used to work 12 hour shifts and but yeah i'm so hungry i got me a cajun burger with a coke float i need to quit buying this coke float it'll be more you know monetarily smart to buy my own ice cream and coke and float it myself have my weeks be going so last week there was a snowstorm and a lot of um, a lot of patients, their medicine has been late. We are getting their medicine in now, but a lot of them been without medicine for like a week, to five days to a week. And they're mad at me. And I was like, there's nothing I can do about that. I can't pull the medicine out my ass. You get your medicine when it gets here and we're talking they're gonna file grievances and stuff. I mean, they're a little heavy on that mayo. I should have told him to hit me on my own break. Yeah, I'm just moving my car. Cause I get when I get out it's dark as hell. So I'm just moving my car by my seatbelt. You can be down the street and just getting some accidents. So. But I'm just moving my car right now. So usually I don't take this off. And I always just put that back on. So usually I do peel call. I actually love peel call because all you do is stay in the med room until it's time to do peel pass but that takes the longest because it takes it's usually like two hours well from five to eight but lately it's been like five to fucking ten thirty because it's just a lot of shit like we had a medicine delay we have to keep going back to the wall 11 but they'll sit there and complain and this, what's taking so long blah 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 i'm trying to help you out and you rushing me it's, calm down but yeah and then I'm in the infirmary, like I said. So all I'm doing, we only got two in the infirmary right now. So I'm just taking their vitals and everything. And one of them, okay, okay I'm back. Um, I'm on break right now. Let's see if you can see me. I'm on break right now and I'm just at McDonald's. Oh shoot, I forgot. Anyways, I'm just at McDonald's. I'm gonna get me some food. Hold on, I gotta put my order number in, but my order number in, but I haven't done nothing for real. Well, actually I've done a lot. Uh, one of our inmates got sent out to the ER, so I had to call them. And the lady on the phone told them, Mission change, can you call that? They been to, I said, um, Has she been admitted? Tells them, She's been admitted. Well, tells them, She's gonna be admitted. I said, Oh, so she haven't been admitted yet? And she She's been admitted. She's waiting for a bed. So she haven't been admitted. I mean, she's waiting for a bed. She ain't admitted. I just, Whatever, whatever you say. You say she's admitted. So, all right. That's about it. And it's 8 o'clock. Get off at 11. And I'm gonna be on break for about an hour. I need mean, 30 minutes. So yeah, just waiting on that. Turn this light up, I don't like folks seeing me. I mean, that's about it. And then when I get off, I'll just tell you all about that I'm done. I'm at McDonald's getting me a soda right now. With some chicken nuggets. Have y'all seen my face? Don't eat a soda. I was doing good. I was drinking water for about two months in a row. And then I started drinking sodas again. This job's stressing me out. I just need something strong. Oh yeah. So I'm driving home now. Um, so I just got my schedule approved and I'm going to be working doubles Monday and Tuesday and I'm going to be working this Saturday for my regular shift. So after Monday and Tuesday, I get the rest of that week off up to that next Tuesday, which is good. But I'm going to pick up a shift that Saturday so I can get overtime and then they do a bonus when you get a, do an extra shift, which is good. And that was the plan all along. But if I get all those days, like five, six, seven days off in the road, of course I'll pick up an extra shift. They're going to pump up. Bye y'all. I used to work 7 to 7, and you know, 16 hours shift ain't gonna hurt me nothing because when I was working overnight, I still woke up around 11, 12, so who cares? So, yeah, 
tonight look pretty good i just did the infirmary and there was only two patients in there and i did walk back in the pill room just to help them out a little bit so i did that too so yeah what else i did but if you want to in depth what correctional nurses do i'm going to do that probably next week or the week after that because i do have a couple videos so i'm gonna do another day in my life with like a 16 hour shift type or a post no i'm gonna do a no I'm gonna do a post 16 hour shift night more than the same. Hey guys, so it's another day in my life, but what I'm, I'm doing my off day. I just got my second dose of my COVID vaccine. I took a Benadryl before, so I hope you don't think I was acting weird. Uh, <coughs> my first vaccine I got, I was. I just make sure my throat ain't swollen. But the first vaccine I got, my lips had broke out in a rash. But I took a Benadryl before I'm gonna take a second one when I get home. But yeah, my lips had broke out in a rash. So instead of 15 minutes, she let me sit there for, um, I hope anybody behind me, for 30. Which is good, that's what you're supposed to do. Somebody said they had a reaction to a pre- I ain't finna hit that car, Emma. Shoot. You know me, you know I can't drive. But, hold on, I'll be, I gotta use the GPS. I don't know where I'm going. I'm gonna let my window up real quick. Um, I'm finna color my hair and I'm finna do the big chop. I'm gonna cut the rest of it all today. And just do finger curls. I'm so, <clears throat> it's a few hours. After the vaccine, I got it at 10, I think it's 7. Um, I feel fine, so I'm just tired. But I took a Benadryl earlier, so yeah, I'm tired and I'm cold. But that's because I got the fan blowing on me. I just, I'm just tired. I'm too late to get up, and I need to turn this light off. But I'm fine. I'm just gonna go back to sleep. <laughs> 